morning. It is. Well, it's Sunday morning, y'all. So, yeah, there's that. So, uh, I got a few properties to do today. We're going to, me and Drew going to, uh, you know, I ain't heard from Bo, but like I was saying yesterday, uh, you know, Bo knows that he is, that he had to be in court on Monday. So a lot of times what Bo will do, y'all, that's how plotting he is. He'll take off to a shelter right before a court date or uh, something, you know, something like that big comes up that he, that's mandatory. And so then if you don't go to court, he, gets, he, he, he can have the shelter call them and tell them, you know, hey, he's at the shelter. He's, you know, uh, he can't appear or whatever. Or he'll go to he'll dip off to a rehab and he'll have the rehab you know, go to uh, call the court or take him to court or something like that. So if he does go before a judge, he'll be coming from a homeless shelter or rehab. He won't be on the streets. So, you know, he won't be on the streets. So, you know, that's how he is, man. I mean, he's a plotting dude, man. I mean, don't make no mistake, man. Y'all think that, y'all think that Bo's damn a big dummy. He's, he's a plotting, he, he, he's always plotting. <laughs> so yesterday, uh, uh, y'all know I picked up the, you know, I lost the bucket, picked up the bucket, and now, uh, uh, so I got all that home. Uh, the Bobcat is still over at the job. I'm glad it's over there, so now I can, uh, me and Drew can get done, and I can go over there and work uh, without having to go home, get the Bobcat and all that there. So, yeah, we got two things that we're gonna do today. Uh, we, got a, we, got, we got the big lawn to cut. It probably takes about an hour, uh, maybe 45 minutes. Uh, it's $150. And, uh, and then we're going back over there to that dam and we're gonna spread seed and straw. Well, Drew's gonna do that while I continue clearing off that other dam like I was telling you uh, the pond bank like I was telling you guys yesterday uh, so yeah not a bad day not a bad day at all uh, now I'm really liking these glasses y'all uh, not to work in for me because it's just too much dust can get in but for driving and all man I'm liking these dude they're really nice man they're really built good too. So big shout out to Toro Eye Company, man. And not affiliated with the lawnmower place. So, yeah. But we should have, uh, you know, today's Sunday. Uh, everything's slow motion on Sunday, man. Uh, you know, like it's 8.30. <laughs> Me and Drew gonna, I'm gonna pick Drew up. And usually, usually, we work on Sunday and it's not pressed or anything. And usually I buy a Waffle House or something, man, you know. Uh, so, two good things about working for Ray on Sunday. Number one, is you get your cash that day. And number two, I usually take you to the Waffle House if we have time in the morning. And usually we have time on Sunday because we work pretty steady, you know. So, just a couple things that, uh, that we need to get done today, and then the rest of us gonna be doing what I wanna do over there at that site, man. Uh, continue uh, making uh, the pond bank beautiful uh, and all of that there. Uh, got some more fencing we're gonna take down, but I but Bo's not here. I don't expect Bo to be calling me or anything today. If he does, I'll be pretty surprised. Uh, like I said, he's done found a bleeding heart you know uh there's another guy that he works for too whenever he used to get uh he you know he kind of bounces from me me and this other guy the other landscaper the other landscaper doesn't doesn't work as much as i do but he does a lot of work on the weekends because he has a full-time job i know him uh, i ain't gonna say his name or nothing but uh sometimes bo will get with him I don't know the guy's number or nothing, uh, but sometimes Bo will get with him when uh, on the weekends, especially a weekend where 
that guy ain't seen Bo in a while, and that guy kind of has a soft spot for Bo like me. So, yeah, there is that, y'all. All right, y'all, so <clears throat> one of the problems that I have uh, on some of these properties that begin toward the end of the season is the grass pumps up so bad. Now, I'm on a, uh, I'm on 3.5, uh, but see, the skag can't cut this. The skag can't move this grass right here. So I'm going to set you guys up and let you guys see me move all this pump that way with this x mark hole. Thank <laughs> you. 
So we got them all the that little long lawns done. Uh, but now what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, spread a little bit of seed. Well, Drew gonna spread some seed over the dam on the back of the dam over here. Y'all saw yesterday where I pulled out all them stumps and put some straw down and hope we get a little bit of rain, but not too much. Just a little bit. Because we can't we don't have a water hose down there. You know, that's a big thing. That's, that's, we can't water it. So, do you know what kind of grass he got? No idea. Probably contractor stuff, so that's what you kind of what you want, I guess. I think he went to Home Depot. Yeah. Contractor. Street rat. Yeah. So, we'll get Drew started on that. I got to go home and get the Bobcat trailer because I'm, I'm going to take this kids to their home today after I get done doing whatever I'm going to do over there. Uh, and... Yeah, I'm trying to probably gonna get that other big stump out up there on the hill by that light over there in the front yard. All right. You know what I'm saying? Uh huh. And that'll be all the stumps there, won't it? I think so. Try to fill in some holes. Yeah. There's some bad holes. Yeah. There, Armadillo's eating up the yard over there. Okay, so I got Drew started on the bank over there, uh, spreading the grass seed out and the straw. Uh, I got a. Uh, take this trailer home and uh, you know uh, but first of all I'm gonna fill the mowers up with fuel uh, so in the morning I don't have to do that uh, but y'all know what today is don't you it's football season I know I don't talk about it much today y'all start if we win it but I'm a dirty bird Falcon fan y'all I'm just saying I know I know I know I've been a Falcon fan since I was a little bit boy. I can't change it, man. So, you know. Anyway, the Falcons are playing today. I love watching the football. I like to record the so, games. And then I got the games uh, scheduled to record I like to watch no today. And all of that. So, it comes on at 1. So once I go home today, I try, I try, I'll go over there and I'll work for a couple of hours over there, just doing some, just some little stuff, you know. Uh, I need to find a place, and I don't know how guys, you know, would do uh, this. I need to find a place on the property there where I can get just get dirt, you know, and move dirt around because there's a lot of bad holes and stuff like that, you know. Uh, where if I just had a place to get dirt, man, I could scoop up uh, dirt and I could do some grading and stuff over there to really help things out a little bit. Uh, so I think I'm gonna go up in the woods somewhere over there and I'm gonna find me a place uh, to dig, you know. Once you once you get underneath all the tree roots and get all them out of the way, man, you can do, I mean, you can, you can just dig. So yeah. Anyway, I'm going to see if uh, the Budweiser's up here. Uh, if not, then no big deal. I'll just head on. I don't on know if I told you guys, but about two weeks ago, I bartered with one of my customers for a 75-inch uh, uh, LG uh, TV. A t I mean, it's a really nice TV. It's about a $1,700 TV. Uh, I bartered with her to uh, do a little bit of work. Uh, so today when I went home uh, I've been wanting to hang the TV up so I took our old TV off the wall and I, and I hung our new TV up and it took a little bit longer than I thought it was going to take so I'm going to uh, so you got a stump right there then you got that you got a big one right there uh, and there's a little one right here. I might try to go on and get it too. We'll just have to see how things roll, man. All right, y'all. So I got one out. I had to dig a pretty deep hole to get that one out. We're gonna get this one out. Y'all see him? Y'all see him? Uh, I'm gonna hang y'all up right here. Do a time lapse.
So y'all saw that one stump. I, I ran out of time. I got tired of fooling with it. I think I can dig it on out though. We'll let it rain a couple of days and then we'll, uh, I'll dig on it some more. I'm just tired, man. Burned out, man. Ready to go home, sit on the couch, watch that 75 inch. Peace out, y'all.